guys and welcome back to my channel. Get some popcorn because this is going to be a long video about God and declarations. Anyway, I just wanted to inform you guys, this will be my last daily bread because I cannot keep up with the daily thing and I have a lot of things in my life because I'm human. I just wanted to let you guys know that there will still be lots of charismatic stuff on this channel and I'll be touching a lot on testimonies, evangelism, and how God wants to um, heal us through horses and how horses are prophetic animals and stuff like that. And um, a lot about my church and youth group and stuff like that. Um, and I'll also do essential oil videos from Young Living and I do have a second channel for that. So if you want, go subscribe. It'll be down in the description below. Um, and I'll also do probably some uh, music videos and stuff about music and piano and talking with other musicians and stuff like that so this channel is gonna change and uh, it's still gonna have mostly kind of the same bases but anyway I just wanted to get into this first because it's been on my heart for a while and I really need to make a video about it so yeah let's get it Revelation 21 4 so I've done a video on this verse before but I had no idea what this verse really was and how powerful it was um, so anyway let's read it and I am going to actually declare it because it is a declaration he will wipe away every tear from their eyes and there will be no more death or sorrow or crying or pain all these things are gone forever come on guys tell me that is not a declaration this is a declaration okay and this declaration will give you revelation because it's in revelation uh, this, this verse just hit me hard um especially since i've been reading steve backland's um book of declarations and how to unlock your future and stuff like that and i thought that that was really awesome and that this verse is a total declaration and we need to declare it over our lives okay because this world is so messed up and if you guys believe that, like, Christians aren't messed up and that they don't go through things or they don't have things as hard as people who don't really believe in, you know, God and don't really believe that God loves them and stuff like that, you've got it wrong because I am a charismatic Christian and we are totally on fire for God. We're firecrackers and we are just totally after God and we love him. And, like, we definitely need to declare that verse over our generations that God will wipe away every tear and that there will be no more death, no more sorrow, no more crying, and no more pain, and that those things are all gone forever because especially this generation really needs that. And, like, all the kids that are going to public school and even the kids that are homeschooled or anything like that need that because you see kids today they're on their screens and they're showing off their body they're not being very modest um they really need that even the kids at my church like my guy friends they're on their screens a lot and they want to bring their screens to a camp that's about focusing on god and so especially um just kids in general this generation needs that because this generation is on their screens and that's one reason why i talk about God and stuff like that on a YouTube channel because it's a social media and kids are always on social media and I really want to touch them especially because they're the next generation and they're the generation that is going to preach the gospel and just just share all these crazy testimonies and so like all Christians have something going on in their life and they are human just like everybody else and I go to a charismatic church with charismatic Christians. I am a charismatic Christian and so are my friends. And I have friends that aren't charismatic, okay? Because I love everybody. And so we're all messed up. My friends are on their screens and we all have like family problems or something like that. But the best part about that is that God gets to come into our lives and he gets to heal us and bandage our wounds. And when we start to clear that verse, um, Revelation 21 4 over our lives then things will start to change our perspective on everything will start to change and so I challenge you tonight and every single night after that maybe for just a month 
or for six months, I don't care. So I challenge you to declare that every single night over your friends, over your family, over your life. And once you start to do that, your, your perspective will change and the people around you will start to change. And you will start seeing breakthrough in your everyday life because when you declare things, breakthrough is very, very obvious in your life, okay? Because this is from another book. When we pray in circles and then we suddenly stop because we give up and we doubt, that is just... That is a very hard place, and that is not what we need to do, because in the book it says that whenever you stop praying, that was the time when you were going to get what you were praying for. Say so you're praying for a house, and you're praying in circles, you're praying in circles, you keep on praying and you give up. Right when you give up is when God was going to give you that, okay? So don't stop praying, you have to pray until something happens. So... Yeah, I just challenge you guys to just declare this verse over everybody that you see because we are going to see a change in this world and it's not going to be a small change. It's going to be obvious, it's going to be out there, and it is going to be so powerful and so ignited because when we start to declare that, we will see this generation be ignited. I mean ignited so come on who doesn't want to see the kids that are on their screens who are showing off their bodies who are just pouring out their life on social media who wants to see those kids ignited because I know I do I'm only 12 and I already have passion for my own generation and I know that this generation is going to be ignited so if you're a Christian don't just do things at church or at your youth group or wherever you go take God with you everywhere and don't just talk about God around Christians because that's going to get you somewhere but it's not going to touch the people who don't have God and don't know how much God loves them okay so just declare that verse over you and your family and your friends every single night because I, I guarantee you you will start to see a change and just a fire. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that and I hope you guys stick around to my channel because a lot of good things are going to happen in the future of this channel and I know God is really going to touch you guys through my video and that you guys are just going to learn a lot and you are going to be able to spread the gospel that I'm giving you guys away to other people who need it. So yeah, bye-bye. Thanks for watching.